It's a blustery night outside, but this one just warm, cozy, and intense. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro, ready to drop the puck on this EA Sports Hockey League showdown. And stirring the pot here after the whistle. Yeah, a little friction, and all of a sudden, guys are getting heated. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Puck moved over to Markov. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Stopped by the goaltender. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Receives the pass. Here's a short pass to your boy Oven. Taken by Russell. With the puck inside the defensive zone. From that angle. And that's picked off in front. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. Caught him just as he was picking up speed, and he's going to pay for it with the trip. Oh, you're spinning with him. You're trying to get your stick into the puck lane, and you end up tripping him up. The old-timers will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Well, to this point, the game is scoreless, and now you've got a real great opportunity with your power play on the ice to get on the board first. That first goal is so critical. Make the opponent chase the game. Crane's got the puck in his own zone. And it's a quick pass to Scott. Right out front! Beautiful stop with the stick! I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. Your boy Ovens won the face off deep inside the offensive zone and tries to make a diagonal pass to Markov. With some momentum driving towards the net, St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Quick pass over to Scott. Tripped up on the play, delayed penalty coming up. Here comes the call. Sin bin bound for tripping. I always hated taking tripping penalties. It always felt like there was something I could have done better than that. Face up. Tempers flaring. Yeah, a little bump together, a little friction. Looks like the guys want to get it going. Penalty to number seven. Two minutes. Off the try, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Stops him cold. And a nasty whack after the whistle here. Yeah, he went after him pretty good there. That's a hard slash. won the faceoff. Marcos lugging the puck, working to shake the pressure from the defensive zone. Toronto's got the puck shorthanded. Moves it to your boy, Oven. Gets it out of his own end. It's a straight-up race for the puck. Moves it quickly over to Markov. The old-timers gain possession in their own end. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Moves the puck up to Carter. And the pass is picked off. Centered out in front, turns it away. Again, the denial by the goaltender. I like the way he tracked. He let that one oh, go boy. after the whistle. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Both sides back to even strength. A great effort by the penalty killers there. Well, no goal on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really. Here he is, all alone. Huge stop by the puck stopper. Oh, yeah, it is, Jeep. It's like he has an open book there. The goalie read every move that the player tried to make. Right to the middle, and that's broken up. Trying to get back on the attack now. Carries it across the line. Toronto's got it now. Whoa. Scores! The captain delivers! Now, 
What a tough break for the goaltender. This thing's just shoveled towards the net somehow. And as it's bouncing around, the goalie can't track it, can't keep his body in front of it. Now he's got to fish it out from behind him. Toronto's got the opening goal in this contest. So much time left. A lot of John back and forth here. It's forever. I mean, the guys look like they're pretty agitated. And now he moves it to party. Time to the goal. Nine minutes, 12 seconds. Centering pass! And that shot gets caught in traffic. And now it's grabbed by Russell. And he moves it up to James. They've got the defense outnumbered. Sends it across. Wrists one, denies him in front. St. Louis has it near the wall. Great defensive effort with the strip. Carries it in. Quick feed to Scott. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Knocked away. Quick pass to Wang. Wang's got it in the defensive end. And they go back on the attack in the offensive zone. And he gets a glove on it to keep it at bay. Well past the midway mark of this period, we got a 1-0 game to this point. He's looking for a dance partner. Yeah, he looks like he wants somebody, anybody to, to engage with. And he slides it quickly to Wang. With possession along the wall. Too much traffic in the lane. Slides it quickly to Carter. Trying to get in all alone. And can't convert. He's not going to like to see that on the replay, James. He doesn't even get a shot off. And manages to clear the zone. Here he is on the oh. wrap around. What a stop. Yeah, that's a race to the post. The goalie wins it there. Gets the pad flat to make the save. The bench warmers gain possession along the wall. Oh, reads it perfectly. Here's a chance. Now a quick pass to Carter. Slides the puck over to his teammate. And that's taken by the defense. When you're ahead, you've got to make a safe play here. Get it behind the net. And now it's over to Scott and makes the save. And now he angles it across to Markov. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. Keeps hold of the puck. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Puck scooped up by Carter. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. They've got numbers. Great defensive effort with the stick. And that'll do it for the first frame in this one. One nothing is the score as both teams make their way to their respective rooms. As both teams get a breather here in this first intermission, we'll do the same and get ready for period number two. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Second period set to go. Look at this. He's calling him out here, Ray. Yeah, he wants to go. He's not very happy. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? St. Louis played an aggressive first period. I thought they had the majority of possession, but they still trail by one. Still plenty of time left in this frame. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. 
play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Over the line they come. Takes a shot, just wide. From the back of the cage with the puck. Referee singling for a delayed penalty. Looks like they caught that slash. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Great burst of speed to come up with it. And now he tries to get it across to Wang. Here's a shot. That's a beautiful shot. He scores! What a little puck look for the play. That's a bad break, James. I mean, the defenseman's supposed to have his stick on the ice. He does. It bounces off it and goes in the net. St. Louis has even the score with a nice play here early in the second. They didn't hang their heads when they were down. They went back to work, and they found a way to tie the game up. St. Louis takes possession of the neutral zone. Toronto's got it from behind the net. Grabs the puck. Great feed from the left side. Here's a short pass to Carter. Comes up with the stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Scott. And that one's broken up. Angles it over to James. James in the corner now. Moves it to James. Great defensive stick work on the play. Gets the puck back onto his stick. And now he moves it to Party. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Takes the puck at the point. Takes the feed. Moves it around along the half wall. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Five minutes they're putting up on the board here. That's a long time to be shorthanded. The players really put his team in a bad spot. Toronto's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. This is where the coaches have to remind the players, don't think of it as a five-minute power play. If the coaches can try and keep the... There's a nasty slash that'll get some attention. Yeah, it should. He looks like he's chopping wood. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. It's all tied up. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. Wow! Scores! And the deadlock is broken! Well, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys worked hard for it. They pressed the play, and now they've got the lead. Toronto's gone up by one here in this second period. Pretty important goal to get to break the tie here as you get into the middle frame and now you have a chance to control maybe the way the game's played. And gets control of the puck once again here in the open ice. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Look out, a two-on-one. Scores! Not the special teams unit we expected to deliver. No, this is a real turning point in the game here as the shorthanded group capitalizes, gets on the board. Oh, that's a great effort, shorthanded. They're just trying to keep the game close, make sure their team doesn't fall back by two, but that effort allows them to tie the game shorthanded. That's great work. Tension's rising. Didn't take much to get this heated up. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Grabs control of it at the point. The bench warmer slipped to start the transition game. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Scores! And he puts his team in front! James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. All kinds of 
hundreds of bodies in front of the goaltender. I don't think he gets a clean look at this as a power play. Look at this, pushing and shoving after the whistle. Yeah, it got heated up pretty quickly. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Sends the pass over. Stopped by the goaltender. Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too. So there's really nowhere that puck's going to squeak through. Toronto's got control of it. Hits in! He scores! Hard to get a much quicker than that. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. The bench warmers have now gone ahead by a pair here in this second. Stretching out the lead here in the middle frame gives you a little bit more flexibility on the bench. The coach can use his whole lineup. Hardy's got it along the wing. Toronto's got the puck. In all alone. Comes up with the stop. He scores! And this place is going bananas. They know what the moment's all about. Well, I guess we know who the first star's probably going to be. That's three for him tonight. Toronto's been dominant tonight as they make their way back to center. They have scored. And a challenge being thrown down here. Yeah, it came out of nowhere a little bit, and the challenge is down. Hammers a shot. Oh, what a stop. Good save. Positional save through traffic. <laughs> Trying to clear the puck. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, it's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. And here's a shot, and that one stopped. Quick pass across to your boy, Oven. Takes it across the blue line. On the attack along the boards. Here's a chance to clear the defensive zone. And it's taken by a teammate and stays in. Gets it out of his own end. Moves it quickly over to Markov. The power play looking anything but as they give up a shorthanded goal with both teams back now at even strength. They're not going to be too thrilled when they get a look at the film on that power play. Ineffective and maybe more importantly, they... Trying to shake loose. Sends it over. Flips it across. Stones him on the breakaway. Heads power deep inside the offensive that. zone. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Shot. The he scores. Now it's only a two-goal game. Oh, so it gets progressively better for them, but they need another one. They gotta throw a quick back-to-back -back goal up here. Ah, uh, the old standby, low stick. The goalie beaten clean here. He can't catch it. The old-timers seem to have found some energy here in the second ray. Yeah, still trailing by two, though, James. They need another one, whether it's now or early in the third. Davis takes the puck. Here's the chance to clear the puck from his own end and manages to clear the zone. Drives it to the front of the net. Quick feed to Carter. Takes the return feed. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Second period nearly in the books here. Right out in front, and that one's broken up. And that one's stolen at center ice. Puck lands right back onto the blade. Slater's moving the puck through his own zone. Looks to get the puck over to Carter. Takes a shot, makes the save, and putting out the fire in front. And that'll do it for period number two. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. It's been a throwback to 80s hockey here, and we are underway here in the third. 40 minutes into this one here, Razor. How do you see things? Toronto's ahead in this high-chance, high-danger game. No use changing the way you're going to play now. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Pokes the puck away. St. Louis gains a hold of it. 
Picks up the puck in his own end. Let's it fly, and he comes up with it. Moves the puck behind the net, and another stop. Dead center, excellent save. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Carter's got it in the offensive zone. And some good footwork to kick it away. And some nice footwork to free the puck up to his teammate. Hardy's taking it from his own end. Quick pass to your boy, Ovid. He scores! Well, don't turn this one off yet. Well, you better not. We're still here. If we're here, That's you right. gotta be here, too. We had enough time to pick a spot, and he went five-hole, beat the goaltender pretty cleanly. The old-timers have got a big one here in the third now. Well, you gotta be careful that the clock melts away fast on you, but now they've got a chance. Your boy Ovens won it. Scott's got the puck. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a short pass to your boy Oven. Gets in front of it. Moves it on over to Markov. Takes the feed, moving in. Move to the middle. Boom! Man, sometimes you just can't get out of the way, but for him, it's been all night. He's been on the receiving end of these types of hits. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. Icing his calls, stopping the play dead. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, St. Louis still needs one more goal in order to even things up. Offense's own face off, and he wins the draw. Too many bodies in the way. Wang stick handling in his own zone. Toronto's got it in the neutral zone. Pass right Whoa. in front. He scores again. Well, you get one, you think you might get two, but after a while, you're like, hey, how many can I get? The puck keeps coming to him, and he keeps finishing it off. Well, that's a quick one-timer right in front of the net. The pass is there. He's got no time to do anything with it, and he beats the goalie. Toronto's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Right in the slot, and a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Slides it across, scores! Two goals in 50 seconds, so quickly on the board. I think we can officially call this one a route now. Yeah, this is a steamroll. This is over. He didn't waste any time. If he would have stopped that puck, the goalie would have had time to readjust. As it is, it's in the net. The bench warmers offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Offside is the call, but we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Toronto showing no signs of slowing down here in this third period up big time. Some pushing and shoving here. It's go time. Absolutely rocked down to the ice there. That was a heavy blow, and that is the end of this bout. And here comes referee Gilles Levesque to clean things up. It's amazing how the energy in the building can seep away when your guy doesn't do so well in the fight. Yeah, nice call him out. Did he ever? This is this is gonna get heated. Toronto's laying off pounding on the opposition tonight, generating numerous scoring chances and converting on what feels like almost all of them. Comes up with the stop.
Toronto's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And he makes the save. James works the puck in his own zone. And now it's over to Harris. Nice pass. And now he angles it across to James. Off the post! Great defensive effort breaking up the pass. And that pass is intercepted. Up along the wing. Puck grab by Green. Puts it in deep. St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. Moves it to party. Solid check to slow him down. Scores! That's three! I had nine of these, James. It is such a cool thing to score three. You feel so good about yourself. What a great release on this one. There's room right over the glove. He sticks it in the top of the net. St. Louis is back at center ice. They're not rolling over and dying on this one. No, not yet, but they've got a long way to go. The coach is trying to tell them there's still time. Feeds the puck across to Slater. Musa quickly over to your boy Oven. Makes the save on the slapper. Solid body contact. Along the half wall with the puck. Rocked on the play. Centering pass. Ahead of steam now towards the front with the stop. Through center along the wing. The bench warmers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Maintains control of the puck. Good defensive stop with the poke check. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And the puck's knocked loose. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. Tripping is the call, and it's pretty cut and dry, it seems, Ray. Well, it's like you, you're in position, then you're not. You reach out, you trip them up, and there's no way to get out of it now. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. He scores! Putting the special in special teams tonight. Uh, the extra work they've done, the way that they've moved some people... helped them cash in more than once on the power play. Toronto's goal-scoring abilities have been on full display so far this evening and here in the third. Really impressive display. They've moved the puck well, skated, really forecheck well. There's really nothing they haven't done tonight. Comes up with the stick save. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. With possession along the wall. A little rock'em, sock'em on the play. And now he tries to get it across to Markov. The old-timers have it from their own end. From the point, looks to make something happen. Puts it to the front of the net. Sends it out right in front. Here he is in front. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Into the offensive zone. Quick feed to Scott. From the slot, wrist shot. Way too much congestion blocks that. Quick pass to Carter. Here's an odd man rush. Sends it over, and that's picked off. Shot with the stop. He puts it in. Yeah, I don't think this is counting, James. I mean, look at that. It looks like a train wreck down there. That's got to be goalie interference. Your boy Oven's going to just shake his head here as he sees the officials wave this off. No goal goalie interference right away. Kind of takes the wind out of the sails and you can see it on the bench too. He's looking for a dance partner. Yeah, he looks like he wants somebody, anybody to, to engage with. There's the final horn and that'll do it here this evening. Well, you look at the final stats here, James, and they had more shots on goal. They had a very comfortable lead. It seemed like they had the puck and the game in control most of the night. They looked like a firing squad out there and the difference was they converted on many of those.